growl. Werewolf. The word werewolf comes from the word were and the word wolf. Wolf comes from wolf, meaning wolf. So far, so condescending. Were, however, comes from the PIE root wero, which means man. From this root, we get such diverse words as world, which meant human existence, the human race, virile, meaning manly, and virtuous, meaning manly. An old English were specifically referred to male humans. The gender neutral term was man or men. You had were men who were men and with men who were women. Were men were not women. However, over time the were was dropped from the male and men adopted man as solely theirs. Men have been doing this kind of thing ever since. The with of with men is where we get wife. It is proposed to have come from the PIE root wipe, meaning to wrap or veil, from which we get words like wimple and wipe, and also to tremble ecstatically, which is where we get words like vibrant and vibrate. Because were men have historically and now historically been awful. Wait, where were we? Ah yes, lisanthropy. Lysanthrope, a better, more gender neutral term for werewolf, comes from the Greek lykos, meaning wolf, and anthropos, meaning human being. Whilst anthropos makes its way into such English words as anthropology, anthropomorphic, and philanthropy, lykos only made it into lysoperdon, a species of fungus that literally translates as wolf fart. So go forth and utilise this new knowledge. Rehabilitate words that never quite made it when you tell the story of the big bad lykos. Reclaim man as gender neutral by bringing were back into fashion. This is a whiff wolf.